Hello, this is Nathan at BrothersOnTech.com. We're looking at the TiVo Series 3, and in this video I'm going to show you the on-screen guide options uh, for this device. Uh, for starters here, I've just uh, pressed the guide button, and you'll see the guide that I typically use, and uh, this is what they call the TiVo Live Guide. You'll notice in the uh, left-hand column, and I can go up and down, it shows me uh, the channels that I've got, and the shows they're currently on. Uh, but you'll see if I pick any particular channel and then I hop over to the right hand column it shows me everything that's coming up on that station. And uh, I prefer this guide because uh, it's just faster than the other one that we'll look at here in just a minute and I can uh, look through things uh, quicker. So you see we can look at any program at the top. It's got the uh, program description and other information about it up there. And uh, it's really the way that I like to go. But you'll see at the bottom of the screen it says press enter for guide options and it also says favorite change slash no filter and uh, if I press enter first of all you see the options we've got here I want to switch to the other style you see I've selected TiVo live guide but I can go to a grid guide and let's select that and that's going to be what you're used to seeing uh, it's the typical program guide we can go uh, forward in time you'll see it's got a little HD icon if that program happens to be in HD and we can go up and down and look through the channels and you'll see it's uh... I think it's faster than it used to be actually I haven't uh, used it in quite a while I don't know if I've used it at all very much on the series 3 but perhaps some recent software updates have made it faster I believe I, I looked at it early on when I got this unit and uh... really that's pretty good I may uh, take a look at this again uh... you'll see that's really typically what you're looking for um, if I press enter again and go back uh, let me just note uh, first of all that using pretty much any menu in the TiVo uh, if you press uh, to the right it'll select things, it'll advance you forward and if you press left it'll typically take you back so it, it's really intuitive the way the thing works but let's look at the, the options here first of all channels I've got favorites selected you can maintain a list of the channels that you want to see in your guide and, and just those. I can also select you receive which is going to show me everything that with my programming package is available to me and finally all which is going to show all the channels that are available in this area whether I subscribe to them or not so I typically like to kind of whittle it down I don't want to see a bunch of junk shopping channels and that kind of stuff in my list so I just have a list of favorites we can also uh, go to a specific day or time and look at that immediately without having to scroll through all the hours and get there manually of course we can change the style of the guide and finally here these last two options are filtering. I can turn the filtering on or off and I'm just pressing left and right to uh, change that and then we can choose a type of filter. If I press right there you can see the types of filters we can look at. So I can just take one of these and have the guide just show something from one of these categories. So let's say that I just want to look at sports. I can select that and maybe I just want to look at football or just want to look at some other type of sport and just see that in my guide. And you can see this is extensive. Uh, we could just make it look for archery. Now, I don't know how often archery comes on TV, but uh, it can't be all that often. But uh, you can see it's very detailed. Let's back it up. I'll press left to go back like usual. I could have it just show HD programming or just show movies and even just show uh, certain types of movies. Maybe I just want to look at uh, anime. Who knows? But you can see it's got an extensive list there as well. So you can have it turn on filtering and have it just show you what you're looking for. Uh, and uh, if you want to, you can turn that on. It's, uh, it's a pretty nice option as well. So I'm going to uh, press uh, Done Changing Options. We'll go back to uh, the typical grid. And I think I'm going to leave it like this for a little while. I'll maybe play around with this to see if I like this uh, grid better at all. But uh, that's the on-screen guide for the uh, TiVo Series 3. This is Nathan, and thank you for watching at BrothersOnTech.com.